So my name is Gerfried Stocker. I'm the artistic director of Ars Electronica. Ars Electronica is an art education and research institution in Austria and since 36 years Ars Electronica is dedicated to this intersection of art, technology and society. Materia Prima is an exhibition about the collaboration of art and science. We are living in a time that is totally dominated by technologies. Science has become extremely popular even in, in our days and science in some extent is even kind of replacing religion. It really became part of our popular culture and there are a lot of expectations that the collaboration between art and science can lead us to new directions because in particular we have a situation at the moment not only here in Europe but I think worldwide that we are really facing very big challenges and problems. We need new orientations, we need new directions, we need a new out-of-the-box thinking. So we are proposing that uh, exchange of ideas and a close collaboration between art and science can lead to new innovations also for our society. And this is what we are trying to show here with Materia Prima, many different uh, projects, very different approaches from digital technology to genetic engineering where artists and scientists are collaborating to explore our world. The exhibition is a result of different activities. In the foreground, of course, is a, a European-wide network project, uh, a network for digital art and science, where we have artist-in-residence programs, uh, a great opportunity where we can send artists to some of the most interesting and advanced research facilities uh, worldwide. So we have projects that are commissioned in this program. Other projects have been, in particular, selected to give this kind of overview. As I described before, we want to really showcase that art and science is not only limited to biotechnology or digital uh, engineering, computer engineering, but it is an issue that is going on in many, many areas. So we purposely selected these projects uh, to give this kind of overview. Another very important uh, aspect in curating this exhibition and putting it together was the idea to make the exhibition itself into a laboratory. We wanted to create a situation for the visitors of this exhibition that puts them, so to say, directly into this position of a creative researcher, somebody who is investigating how things are working, who is trying to find the story behind the technology or the science, but also maybe being able to create new stories of how art technology can work together and new stories also of how technology and science are shaping our culture and our life. This exhibition is only possible because we have a very strong and, and fruitful collaboration with Laboral, in particular here in this European Union funded project, the European Network for Digital Art and Science. And it's a project where seven uh, European institutions, cultural institutions, are joining forces, uh, their knowledge, their know-how, their experience to create a new idea or also a kind of new point of view, a new perspective into this development of art and science. The collaboration between Ars Electronica and Laboral is actually a very, yeah, has a long and rich tradition already. Uh, even before Laboral was opened, we had some uh, exchange. Uh, then uh, uh, in the opening exhibitions and even the years later, we were collaborating on joint exhibitions. And just recently, this collaboration got, so to say, in a next uh, level because uh, Laboral and Ars Electronica are working together with other cultural organizations in Europe on this digital network of art and science. And the goal is to bring artists together with uh, top-level research institutions worldwide, but then also to use this project as a kind of inspiration to a wider field, um, to inspire other artists to explore uh, this intersection of art, science and technology, but also to disseminate to bring this, so to say, to reach out uh, to society, to have school classes, 
the so-called ordinary normal people also involved is. And I think this is a very important part of the collaboration between Ars Electronica and Laboral, because both institutions are on the one side going very deep into artistic experiments, artistic research. Both institutions have a very good experience in collaborating with uh, science institutions, with the industry, and both institutions have a very strong dedication to education, to bringing out the information and involving as many as possible people. And I think this is something that in this exhibition in Materia Prima is really done on a very exciting level from the artistic research and development all the way down to the dissemination to the broad audiences.